all women, I believe, all women who are not damaged and who are act who actually like you are looking for a long-term relationship. I believe it is in their genes as women to be looking for a long-term monogamous relationship with one guy at all times and if she's not she is truly damaged and you should leave her immediately. I'm going to discuss this a little bit more but Check out my beautiful rooftop pool. Look at this. We've got a beautiful 360 degree view of the city. This is not million dollar views, this is billion dollar views. And late at night, we set up, and we have our own DJ. It's uh, next level, next level, beautiful beautiful stuff and um, so this is a great place to, to pull girls late at night where we're pulling girls back to the pool late at night and uh, set one of the, one of our friends is a DJ we're setting up decks up here it's next level stuff beautiful and um, one of the discussions that has popped up and I want to uh, I want to talk about that with you guys right now is that some guys they're going to be dating a girl or seeing a girl and she's going to tell them that she's not really into having a, a serious relationship what that means is that she's not into having a serious relationship with you there and if she's sleeping with you been dating you for quite a long time and she's decided that she's just going to continue sleeping with you and keep it as some sort of a weird sleazy open relationship where she possibly has the opportunity to sleep with other guys you are dating a whore um, she belongs on the streets uh, and you should end that immediately 99% uh, of I don't know what the percentages are I don't want to throw out a percentage but I would say the majority of women are looking for a long-term monogamous relationship and if she's not looking for it with you, you're not her man. She's looking for somebody else. And when she finds him, she's instantly going to be with him. So let me explain. She tells you that you're, you, she's sleeping with you, she's in a relationship with you, and then she... Uh, she says she doesn't want to take it too seriously she's happy to sleep with you and date you there's like a, a thin veil sort of an assumption there that it's monogamous between you and her but I promise you that if she meets the guy of her dreams tomorrow it is on she's going to want to marry him she's going to take him very seriously and you're going to be forgotten immediately they're all I would say the not I won't say all because there's a lot of whores out there that belong on the streets that it doesn't matter what guy they find they're not going to want to settle down with him they're truly damaged women they're on drugs you find them in the nightclubs quite often uh, I would say all of them are on tinder <laughs> and your job as a man is to when you get into a relationship with a woman like this there's either two things happening she belongs on the streets she's a whore or she just hasn't found him yet and you're not him and so then you need to remove your you need to take away your feelings and just sleep with her as if she's one of your regulars and just treat her the way that she's treating you while getting back out there looking for a higher quality girl that will settle down with you and actually likes you for you now that doesn't mean that I'm saying that you need to marry every girl that you date and she has to be in love with you but I would say that even if you have a rotation of girls, every single one of those girls should be dedicated to you and willing to, uh, if you call upon her to marry you, marry you. 
or settle down with you or be extremely monogamous and, and make it a serious relationship. You want all the girls that you're sleeping with, even if you've got a rotation of three girls or five girls or whatever, you want every single one of those girls to be kind of in love with you and willing to get really serious with you in a monogamous way and they're definitely not sleeping with other guys. Now, if you are with a girl that is showing signs that she's not willing to settle down with you, sleep with her, make sure that she's like the third or fourth or fifth option on your rotation of girls and focus more on the girls that take you seriously. Now, as men, no one's going to save you. The world is a mean and nasty place and you have to look out for number one. And if you're with some hoe from the streets who uh, pines over Chad and she want, she's always thinking about him and, and you're just that guy that's um, uh, keeping her company until he eventually arrives, which he probably never will because she's going to be too old before he, um, any guy arrives that's going to take her on. And she's probably slept with many guys like that in the past, but they didn't want a relationship with her for probably a multitude of reasons. And she's with you because she doesn't realize that you're actually on her level or slightly above her already. And she doesn't want to settle down with you and she doesn't take you seriously because she spent too much time on Tinder or in the nightclubs. Then you need to identify that as a man. That The onus is on you. And that's what this video is about. You need to identify that girl and not take her seriously. Not let yourself get emotionally invested in her uh, and avoid the long-term emotional damage that women like this cause men. They're happy to run around the clubs and Tinder and sleep around with the types of men that they truly desire, but those men don't come back. Those girls are used up as a Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday night girl, you know? She never gets to meet them on a Friday or Saturday night, does she? And then you gotta ask yourself, if Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, she's sleeping with the guy from Tinder or the nightclub, and she doesn't get to see him on a Friday or Saturday, is she seeing you? If she's not seeing you on a Friday or Saturday night, then that means that she's seeing you on a Thursday maybe, or a Sunday. And she's saving a Friday and Saturday nights looking for the next chat. You're not even in the Friday, Saturday slot. You're not even good enough for that. You want to be in a position where you have a, if you are still looking for, you know, a girl to settle down, you haven't found her yet and you want to play the field. Well, you want to be in a position where you've got your Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday girl, you know, You've got, your other, you've got your girls for Thursday and maybe Sunday and then maybe Friday, Saturday you tell all the girls on your roster that you, you're having poker night with the boys but really you're out um, clubbing and dating searching for the next one. You want to be in that position where you're running your weekly schedule and you have total control over your dating life and if you don't and you're just hoping you're what I call a leaf in the wind and she's the wind and she can just she's got total control over everything that happens and you're not running the schedule it's time to go to the website my website on this channel sign up and do some cold, cold approach coaching with myself so that you can get firstly some uh, more leads of better women in your life and I can spend hours just just drilling all of this into your brain until you fully understand what you need to do as a man because I will red pill black pill whatever <laughs> the hell out of you but I'll give you actionable steps on how to change it and it will and has many changed many men's lives it truly has the, the results that a lot of these men have got is truly just mind altering and the more I'm coaching, the more I realize that my stuff works better than any other coach out there. I look at some of the coaches out there and just, they're all frauds. They don't know what they're doing. I'm certain that I, if you're in that situation where you're struggling with a girl like this, 
reach out to me. I guarantee that I can change your mindset and give you strategies that you've never heard of before and help you massively in your dating life. Guaranteed, guaranteed. It will change the way you look. Because I'm even here, I'm meeting up with guys that are traveling the world, that are wealthy, they're making a lot of money, um, and they still don't, they're, they're not operating on my level. There's levels to this. And I'm operating on a such a high level that you guys out there that are struggling, I can definitely help you, 100%. If you're in a situation where a girl, uh, you like this girl and you're being used up, uh, let me let me change the way you see the world, and uh, I can. Anyway, I'm gonna get myself a coffee and and enjoy my beautiful view of the city from here. Look at this, 360 degree. Beautiful, beautiful. I'll see you guys in the next video.